Hello, ladies and gents. Welcome back to another episode of Skyrim No Fast Travel Challenge. It's episode 20. 20! All right, we made it 20 episodes. And um, we're back here in, what you call it there? Uh, Karthwaston. And uh, we had recently liberated it from some uh, cell swords or silver hand or whatever. I don't know what the hell their name is. I completely forgot. <clears throat> and um, we're going to continue our adventure from here. Now, some of you might be see seeing the camera move a little bit faster, and all of a sudden I go to the map, and it's just like, oh, man, and I'm not using the main you know, menu, which is this, or anything like that. The big reason is because I decided to play today with keyboard and mouse. Just wanted to see what how it was. Probably, uh, it, I'm still going to do the usual, like, traveling in third person when we get into, you know, caves and stuff like that do uh, first person and then there's um, but I don't know all the controls yet I know strangely enough uh, C is auto run I knew there was an auto run in this game but it's not for controller unfortunately um, which is a shame but in terms of the favorites menu no that's uh, to wait I completely forgot uh, let's see Fav favorite menu favorite menu favorite menu it's Q. That's convenient, actually. And so, yeah. Oops, wrong, wrong key. Anyway, so we're going to continue on from here. J is journal, obviously. Um, I just kind of assumed that one. Uh, right, there's that. And then there's the Grimoral, which is speak to the leader of Dawn Guard and the way of the voice. Shrouded Grove. Where am I, actually? I forgot to install... Nope, 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 nope. Uh, uh, mm, uh, leave it. Remove it. Whatever. Oh, that's actually pretty easy. Oh, it's okay. It's a ASWD to move the map. I'm way across here. Oh, right. I said I was going to go to Markarth. So let's do that. Place a marker. And uh, let's head on over to Markarth. What do you guys say? All right. Yeah. And this time, I don't have to touch anything. Just hit C. I don't know why C is the auto run button, but just hit it and boom, I'm running. I don't have to do anything. And that makes me happy. All right. So I have to head, head this way. I think. I don't know. It's a bit scary because the roads are just like they're non-existent. Maybe if I follow this one, it'll like curve back around or something. So I've never played with keyboard and mouse ever because I hated the way that the that the 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 way the mouse moved, the cursor itself, not this, but like say you go into the map here, the mouse feels very sluggish. Like I move and it's like it's like mouse accelerations enabled. I think that's enabled by default. You can't... I've, there's never been an option to turn it off, so I assume it's just enabled by default, which is kind of sad because nobody likes mouse acceleration. It's awful. the hell was that? the hell are you trying to pull? All right, what do we got? We got um, White Run that way, which is pretty cool. And Markarth, yes! We're going the right way, people. Now... Last episode, if I'm not mistaken, I was a bit scared because I was like, where is the road? And um, it took a while to find the road, but then we found that little village. I don't even, I've already forgotten the name of it, Karth something. And uh, we helped those people out. I'm going to head on over to Markarth, see if there's anything there. Um, I do recall in Markarth that a woman is potentially going to get murdered. And I guess you can actually save her. So I'm going to try. I'm going to attempt to save the woman. Won't be easy, but I'll attempt it. Hopefully the guards won't be like, Hey, you can't do that! I'm like, he was literally going to murder her. What do you want me to do? Nothing? I doubt it. There's some weird travelers going on here. I'm... Uh, Time to find another. Oh, you guys are twins? Find another job. Yep, they're twins. <laughs> that was weird. 
Same voice, same look. They're inseparable. It's so adorable when twins match. What's this? Oh, right, it's a cave I've already been to. Did I, did I finish it? No, no, I didn't. I passed by it on the way here, right. And, uh, I could go in. It's not too far from Markarth, so if I ever want to go in there, I'll just come back. It's on the map now. So, I just got done. As most of you have probably seen, I haven't been doing a lot of work lately. But, I got lucky. Well, you could say lucky. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. Oh, right. You're a Forsworn Forager. Isn't it creepy how they just run up to you like that? I think it is. It's a tad creepy. They might as well be breathing heavily, like... <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know what's been going on with me lately. I just haven't been doing my work, and uh, today, I lucked out. I lucked out. I can so aim better with mouse... Okay, I, as I say that. Is she an old woman? Yeah, what the hell are you doing out here fighting? You should be at home, like, nursing a baby or something. Um, with boobs like that, she should be. Oh, I almost walked into it, son. You almost got me. Are you sure about that? Because, I mean, I'm gonna about to knock you into the water. And say goodbye to my arrows, I guess. Bye. <laughs> A Viking funeral. <laughs> See, I can, I can do that because I've got plenty of arrows. All right. Garnet. Fine. Take all my arrows. I don't care. See, look at this. Look, 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 look. look. Hold on. Let's lift her up a little bit here. Old woman, young body. Just something wrong about that. Oh my god, I love auto run. Auto run's so much better. It should be in every MMO type game. I mean, it's not an MMO, but you know what I mean. It should be in every game that's just like this. Open world. Gotta run a lot. Well, you don't have to, but I am. Oh, that's right. I left Lydia. <laughs> I forgot I left her alone to get to where I needed to go. Because her pathing is so stupid. It's so bad. Like, why can't they follow me? Why is that so hard? And why does audition always constantly drop samples? I don't understand that. Doesn't seem to affect my audio. It can drop as many samples as it wants. It's not affecting my audio. So I don't know. Are we here already? Nope, we're on our way though. There's the Kachit. I know, some of you might be like, oh, you're so boring, you follow the road. Ugh. Whoa, dude, your armor looks cool. So this is Markarth armor, huh? Yeah, vampire hunters, blah, blah, blah. There was one time I caused trouble outside this, uh, outside Markarth, and I could never come back here. Like, they all, they just wanted to try and kill me. The whole time. I don't know why. I think it was because somebody tried to kill me before. The force warned of taking Polskager mine. We're the only ones left. You two head inside and get some rest. I'll send word to the Yarl. Hey, I, feeling sick? I could possibly help. Am I? Am I feeling sick? Yeah, reduced. Okay, I got bone break fever. Probably have to rest in order to get rid of that. It's been a while since I've rested, so. Stupid dog. Hey, you be kind to that dog. Are you all right, damn force Only a matter of time before they hit here too. 
Seems Cole Skager mine got hit by four swords. Another one again? Madmen get more bold every season. <laughs> what, they're only Marvel seasonal madmen? Are the only survivors. I'll be sending word to the Jarl about this. But I don't know when help will come. I am sure Pavel would be grateful. And we'd all rest a little easier. <clears throat> That's nonsense. You can't handle a group of forsworn by yourself. And who the hell says you? Your axes don't get you. Your magic will. Oh please. I got both. That I do. If you want to grab a pickaxe and dig up some iron, feel free. I'll pay Sweet. for anything you bring me. Oh wow. Alright. All right. All right. Let's um Let's go kill some forsworn. Uh, there you go. Yeah. Easy. Excuse me. Been tending your hounds. You smell like a wet dog. And you look like an asshole. Doesn't feel great to be called names, does it? All right. I'm just gonna save. I know it auto save, but I'm just gonna save it anyway. Okay, here we go. I don't have Lydia anymore, but. That was her choice. She wanted to be stupid. Now I gotta fix it again. Um. I mean, is 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 that a force warrant? It doesn't look like it. I'm one of the miners. Nope, didn't think so. Sweet. Well. Don't have much to say to you. Work. Yeah, get off of this stuff so I can use it. Oh my god, whatever. Need yeah, I need you to move. Dick. Alright. So I'm going to check every inch of the mine just to make sure that I cover everything. How is this dude still working in here when the four sworn supposedly have uh, taken it over? Yes. Here, I'll make a ton of noise, too. <coughs> Can't believe I... <coughs> I go that long and I only get two pieces. It's a good thing there's no durability on the uh, pickaxe, because that would suck. So, the mouse sensitivity in-game is all the way up, like, halfway up the uh, the meter. It's like, it's, it's pretty, I, mean, I might switch uh, C to uh, crouch instead of auto run, because I keep hitting C to crouch, because I'm used to that key. What do we got going on here? Is that Forsworn? Hey. What? Are you what? feeling sick? No, I'm not feeling sick. Thank God you're not using this. But have you seen any Forsworn around here? I was supposed to get rid of them. Unless this is the wrong place. Because you guys seem pretty content down here. When apparently there are Forsworn here that are Forsworn to kill you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That was dumb. But seriously. I think maybe this is not the right place. You got a nice little setup up here, buddy. I'm going to take your gold, though. <clears throat> uh, anyway, I don't think anyway, if, I, don't, I don't think I finished my uh, what I was saying earlier, um, but I've been lazy the last couple days. So, luckily, I got today off because, well, yeah, I com wrong, wrong place completely. Oops. Um, because it's snowing heavy outside, and I'd rather live to see another day than to try and make it to work in like two hours. Apparently, on the highway, it was like 
30 miles an hour or less. And we're talking like, you know, you can get up to 65 miles an hour on there. So what that need? would take forever. Where is this mine? It's completely not in here. I just went into the wrong place and thought it was cool. Uh, controls. Can I change these? I hope I can. Because we're going to do... Oh, good. Automatically switches to the other one. Good. Thank God. Makes it easier on me. All right. There we go. Pressing control to, to auto run is easy enough. Like, I'm just too used to C being crouch in most other video games. I'd rather it just be that. Bark, bark. Good dog. Da, 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 da. Listen to the roaring water. Do I go this way for it? Or do I go back the way I came? Uh, yep. Go back the way I came. Now, I remember the... I don't remember it, but I remember that the command I used last time to get Lydia back was... It basically teleported me to her. I want to know how to get her to me. Because I'm getting sick of the NPCs not being able to follow. It's really annoying. Maybe after this, that's what I'll do. I'll, I'll get the, the command to do that again. And uh, we'll have another adventure. We'll find out where she went. And maybe we'll, um, we'll go from there. Okay, do I go? Yeah, I gotta go up here. It's not bad playing with a keyboard and mouse, but then again, I haven't really done any melee yet, so I don't... Don't really have anything to compare it to. Shooting's one thing. It's one thing I'm used to with keyboard and mouse, but... Uh I don't know why, but it feels easier to access things. A little bit. Still hate the mouse, but or the uh, yeah the cursor movement, but it's something I'm dealing with. I don't have to use it all the time, so it's whatever. The sensitivity kind of takes me back, though. I'm like, it's kind of weird that I have to have it halfway up the meter before it actually, you know, feels like I'm moving fast enough. How did I miss? What is going on? What the hell was that? Why did I miss? How did I miss? I was shooting right at him. Shot it at his head the first time. Alright, nobody knows. Right? I'm not seeing anything on the comp. Oh, yep. How do I cancel? R. Okay. Oh, they're coming from over there. I'm hidden. Where are you? Okay. So, there's the leader in there. <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to mine the gold ore while they can while they're here. And they can't even hear me. <laughs> They'll be like the hell's going on? What is what is Sven thinking? People are gonna know we're in here. Oh, they already do, my friend. They already do. Alright, so they're all down that way. I'm gonna go over here and find out what's going on over here. Let's see what's down here. A bunch of stuff. Yes! Bunch of gold ore. That's what's down here. I'll take it. Of course, I think the guy said, bring it to me and I'll give you money or whatever. I found a flawless garnet in there? What? All right. All right, let's just gonna chip away at each spot. Why not? It's free. 
I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. Can you imagine a pickaxe to the head? I can't. I don't want to. The pickaxe is actually my melee weapon of choice in Battlefield 1. It's pretty devastating, actually. Whoa. Oh, I thought that was floating. I'm like, what is that? Is that a bottle floating? Like, what's going on here? Physics breaking game. Not that it hasn't done that before. This game breaks a lot of rules. Yeah, I killed one guy. Apparently he made enough noise for them to come all the way across the country. Oop. Hello. How the hell? I didn't make any noise and you're just like, oh. <laughs> she almost did a backflip. Don't move. Stop moving. Don't. Forsworn, you guys are easy. Except for when you move. Shoot, you ass! Oh my god, he got stuck and I missed. Because I thought he was going to move through there. So, you know. Okay, now that makes more sense. Look at her body. Look at her face. She's young. Uh, unfortunately dead, but young. That's the kind of body that belongs on. Uh, that's uh, that's the kind of body that belongs on a woman like that, not an old woman. Okay, so apparently your boss didn't give two craps about you guys, and you're just like, he's like, nah, you guys will be fine. And then you're not. What's this? Potion of strength. Oh, uh, I'll take that arrow. Thank you. Can I find one of the other ones that I shot? Because I did miss a couple times. Hey, there we go. <laughs> right there. Sweet. Let me see if I can get a good height advantage on this guy. What the? Where did he go? Is he over here? Well, I know that's ore, so I'm going to have to grab that, but That's somebody different. That's not their boss. Two times damage for sneak attack and critical strike on the second one. Very nice. Getting better. Getting better. You know, I found out recently, and I, I don't like the fact that I'm better like this, but... <clears throat> playing Star Wars Battlefront this last weekend, I think. I love my third-person shooters. I thought I was good at them. And I'm not terrible at Star Wars Battlefront in third-person. But when I went to first-person, it was so much better. The problem with third-person shooters these days, and it seems to be a recurring trend, is that just even with this, even with Skyrim, it's hard to judge where your shot is going to land just simply because either you're going to hit whatever object you're trying to hide behind or you're going to uh, misjudge the distance and it's just it's terrible <clears throat> forsworn briarheart no no where are you going there you go I am doing my worst once I'm leveled up bro with the archery you're done well, I mean, you're dead anyway, but you get the point. Okay, I will be able to own with the bow. All right. This place is mine now. I mean, <clears throat> it's Pavo's slash mine. So you're not a dwarf. You don't deserve to have a dagger of theirs. This place is booming with ore, man. This is going to, well, I don't remember if uh, smelting actually helps your blacksmithing, but still. I'm getting resources to help my blacksmithing later on, which is good because I need it. Uh, 
Can you imagine? They had to program the character. Hey, I got an amethyst. They had to program the character to like recognize when the ore is on the wall or if it's on the ground. They had to program it like that. Hey, free ingots and ore. I'll take it. What is this? What's going on? Oh my god, this place goes deeper than I thought. We are so exploring this. Because I killed everybody in here, so what does it matter? Unless that goes to a place that I was already in. Which I don't recall being below anything. Anything over here? Nothing over here. There was that one spot. Okay, so shift is to walk. What's to... What's the sprint? Hmm. Left alt? What? No. Run. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, no. We want shift to be sprint because that's what makes sense oh, okay yeah so the hole probably goes down here so yeah it would have so i probably would have hurt myself well does it i did go up and around so maybe i don't know i'll check the uh I'll check over here first things first i'm gonna get this magica thank you oh my god i'm rich maybe not but still it's gold. Okay. It's gold. But again, it's very little return for how long I stay there picking at this stuff. It's a good maybe 10 to 15 seconds, and I only get two ores. Sometimes I get jewels, which is pretty cool. Amethyst and uh, whatever the other thing was, but... I don't know. I feel like it's not much of a return. Oh, maybe it isn't a place that it goes down to. Maybe I actually found a, another spot. Well, I'm going to get this stuff first before I go down that hole. Because you never know. I may not be able to come back to here. So, you got to prepare. And I'm going to prepare by taking all the gold ore. I'm rich. Rich. I should be on that show on Discovery. Gold Rush. My character should be on there. The ore vein was depleted. Now, I found it interesting that one time where I found ore outside. Like, I didn't think I could find it out in the wild. I figured it was just part of, you know, the mines and stuff. Apparently not. Apparently this stuff exists outside, too. I think it was iron, but nonetheless, it was... Look at this. It was not in a mine. It was outside in the open air just randomly. And I'm just like, wow, I could just stumble across this stuff. So anytime you take a look at the, the rocks around the gold ore, anytime a rock looks like that, it's got nothing. But if it looks like that, it's got something. Could be gold. Could be iron. Could be whatever that other stuff is. Or a Richard Lilium something. Whatever. I don't know what it is. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. All right, time to explore that hole. <laughs> oh, wait. Not yet. Ha <laughs> ha. More gold. I am a rich stinker. Now, some of you might be one, you know, kind of like yelling at me like, Man, you, you're cheating with the mods and stuff. It's, it's not cheating. It's enhancing. Okay? You have to look at it that way. And when you finally accept the fact... I missed this spot? How dare I? When you finally accept the fact that it's not cheating, but it's enhancing your experience, you can get past the fact that I have unlimited bag space. Essentially. Essentially, I could potentially carry up to that much, but I'm not going to. I'm never going to carry up that much because I'm always doing stuff with the things in my inventory. 
Or as you British say, inventory. Alright, I'm gonna save first. Because I don't know what's down there. Could be a giant spider. <gasps> Whoa! Oh. Is this where they dump the dead bodies? No. I knew it. Yeah, I've already been here. I knew it. I knew it was only... It, mm -hmm. Just a quick way to get back to the beginning, that's all. Okay. I knew it wasn't anything special. I had a feeling. I was like, hmm. I mean, you can dump ore down there, but... All right. Well, whatever. Well, you know, I thought maybe it'd be something really cool, but it's not really cool. I'm not disliking using keyboard and mouse. This is actually kind of nice. I just don't like the the cursor. It's uh, it's annoying. The cursor sucks because it moves so crappily. Like, all right, skills. Is there a short shortcut for skills? Opening the skills and whatnot. Ah, system. Uh, quick magic is P. Map. Journal. Wait. There is a quick save. What? It's F5. Uh. Something happened with my uh, Adobe Audition and all the waveform got really big. Oh. Oh, for some reason, it's, um, my scroll wheel is, is, like, affecting it. I hope that didn't just raise the volume. Okay, no, no, I'm just, okay. Whew. Why is it doing that? That's so weird. Anyway. It's just zooming in or something, or maybe not. Maybe that did get really loud. That's bad. S stop. Why are you doing this? I guess I won't do that anymore. What the hell? Why is... Alright. I'm just gonna quick save. There's quick save in, in this game? Why did everybody say quick save didn't exist? I don't know. People were saying quick save didn't exist in this game. I have no idea why. I smell... Baking. Bakery goods. I think one of my parents is making Hillsbury Doughboy cinnamon rolls. <gasps> Let's be honest, though. If I actually went to work this morning, okay, and because I was actually up, not exactly at four, I was actually up at five. But if I had gone in, I'd be home by now. Or I'd be on my way home. No. Yeah, I'd be on my way home. Because I'd get out at, at 12.45. Yeah. No, I'd be on my way home. And uh, so I'd probably, you know. Where are you guys going? Is there a dragon? Is just a guard and has to okay, well, I didn't ask you what you were doing. Or what you sold. Like I don't yeah. care. Don't those uh, I mean, I do. Depends on... I mean, I've got... A fancy... What was... Uh, that's right, Q. Yeah, I've got this amazing great sword. So I don't know what the hell you're talking about, bro. So there's no shortcut... Yeah, you can help me by shutting up. I gotta talk to this dude. Kolskiger mine is lost, friend. No, it's not. Drove them off by yourself? I killed them. I didn't drive them off. We'll head back to work right away. Take this. It's the least I can do. Sure. Seven hundred fifty. Man, you're probably the most generous person that I've run into. For your help. Oh wait, wait, what? What? You're sending your orchestra? What? Damn it! I left the room too early. 
What's with the loading today? I really hope I didn't screw up the freaking audio. May your next fight, huh? I'm just here to mine. Yeah. The most well-known stronghold is Dushnik Yal. Here, I'll mark it down for you. Nice. All right, I got a new place to go to. Not right now, but um, move it. Is any there? It is. Key. Oh, now it doesn't get affected. Scrolling inside the map, and it's fine. Nothing. Well, anyway. Where's the dude that said he would pay me for all the stuff I looted? Or whatever. Stuff I found, I should say. Got order, dig. No, you don't. I took it all. <laughs> Skaggy. Skaggy. Stop calling this a stupid dog. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Huh? You okay? Everybody treats you like shit, huh? I know. I get the same feeling. Where is what was the name of the dude? Was it Dagri? Was it Skagi? Lost? Yes, I want to know where the the dude is. So there's no shortcut menu to open the skills uh, menu or no shortcut button, excuse me. That sucks. But there's a quick save. Why did everybody think there was no quick save in this game? I don't get it. Oh, you know what? They were probably saying for consoles there wasn't a quick save. And that's very true. There wasn't. Alright, I need new, uh, more health. Archery is at 65. Ranger. 15% chance of paralyzing the target for a few seconds. Can draw a bow 30% faster. I'm only five levels off to get that. Oh, it sucks. All right, how about armor? I got heavy armor on, correct? Fists of steel. Unarmed attacks with heavy armor gauntlets do extra damage. Nice. 25% armor bonus if wearing all heavy armor. Head, chest, hands, and feet. I'm pretty sure I'm wearing heavy armor all over the place. You got uh, heavy armor, heavy armor, heavy armor, not heavy armor, heavy armor. So yes, that would be a yes. Wait, what else do I have that needs to be done? Like a whole bunch of stuff, really. Speech, you know, that'd be nice. Buying and selling prices are 20% better. Bribery, lock picking, sneaking. You won't trigger pressure plates. That'd be nice. But let's be honest. I'm basically going to be focusing archery and heavy armor. So I might as well use this. Alright. That's what I'm talking about. Still quick save. Alright. Yeah, that was weird. I'm not sure why it did that. But hopefully it doesn't screw up the... Uh, the audio. Alright. So now, real quick, I am going to, um, once again, look up the command to get Lydia back with me. Real quick. I know. I know. It's a waste of time, but I really should write these down. Okay. See, it says player move to. I don't want to do that, though. Okay, there's how to find Lydia. No, everybody says player move to. Okay, there you go. So, P-R-I-D, and then her, her character ID, and then move to player. Now, I don't know if this is going to be correct, but um, 0, 0, A, 2, C, 9, 4, move to player.
Expected end of line. I don't think that's correct. Does it have to be like one? Does this actually have to no no period here? I didn't think so. Are you sure it's not like move to player? Oops. Expected end of line. What does that even mean? Doesn't I typed I typed in this. Okay, he hit and then typed in resurrect. Oh, okay, I see. Oh I see. Okay, okay, I got gotcha. you. Yep, okay. Move to player. Move to player. Your suit, then I could Bingo! Got it. Okay, so that's what that was trying to do. You put in her ID, and then you type in move to player. Thank God! All right. I'm never going to remember her. Uh, where the hell were you? Seriously. I'm right behind you. All right, she's still... Lead on. She's still following me. How much you want to bet she was still trying to figure out how to get to me? pretty messed up I know she could have been anywhere in this world and I, I don't know where she would have been all right so basically anytime that happens I hit PRID and then put in her ID which I'll never remember and then move to space player got it now I know how to get her to me I don't want to go to her I want her to come to me and thank God she didn't lose any of her stuff or mine right you still got all my stuff how can I serve you, my Thane? You can serve me by getting on your knees. Yeah, she's still got all my stuff. Okay, we're good. Let's get going, then. Yes, we will. All right, Lydia. Be ready to uh, down a possible murderer. Yeah, you're probably right. Go with a sword. We're going to have to deal with this. I know it. I'm not going to let him murder an innocent woman. Nope. Oh, yeah. Ha! Ah! I was, it was close because I didn't know who it was going to be, but that was perfect. Yeah. We'll handle things from here. Move along. Yeah, you were totally gonna save that woman. I said move along. The Forsworn are just a bunch of madmen. We have everything under control. Stay out. You sure did. Mm-hmm. No, you didn't. A woman attacked right on the streets. Yeah, no, she wasn't. Alright. Did you see what happened? I'm so sorry. I hope the eight give you more peace in the future. Who the hell are you? Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. Ah. Hmm? No. I was just getting some fresh air. Had one too many pints of mead at the Silver Blood Inn. Yeah. My kind of drinker. My note? No, that's yours. Must have fallen out of your pocket. No, it didn't. Fallen out of his pocket. <laughs> Until next time. Or his stump. We'll things from here. No, you Hold won't. Alright, who... Did I think he tried to kill you, right? Oh gods, that man nearly yep. Me. Why do you look so sick? Like she looks thin. Here, I was gonna bring this to my sister, but I think you should have it. No, I don't have any idea. Silver emerald necklace. I was just shopping for a pendant for my sister back in the Imperial City. I've heard of them. Something about the men who live in the hills and now, it's it's just like the part of the game where I'm supposed to find out what where the who the Forsworn are. Like I'm 
just visiting here from Cyrodiil. All right, calm down. I'm just questioning Farewell. God. He he tried to kill Margaret right in front of me. Yeah, don't worry. I saved her. She promised no. to blow me later. She's such a nice woman. Comes by every day looking for jewelry for her family in Cyrodiil. Is it because she's a noble? Maybe. Why would anyone want to kill her? It doesn't make any sense. I'll get to the bottom of this, madam. No, I'm not what looking to buy anything. Did Everything. You see that, madman? A forsworn Did I see him? Did you see me city. chop his leg off? Think he worked down at the smelter. A lot of laborers there are sympathetic to the forsworn. I bet they, they are. They promised people to kill off all the Nords that rule over the Reach. Nothing but murderers and saboteurs. He's the first different voice I've actually heard. This has ruined my entire day. <laughs> no, it hasn't. We'll handle it. You're an ass, bro. Okay. We made it to Markarth. All right. Not sure what else I can do, but I, you know, I guess I'll just silver blood in. Let's go to the inn. Have a pint. Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Just here to drink. What's up, Clepper? Peaked. Clepper? Should be home in bed. Peaked? Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Well, how nice of them. Heard any rumors lately? Have you seen that shrine of Azura? No. They say the Dark Elves built it after they fled from Morrowind. Okay, but I'm a Wood Elf, so I have nothing to do with them. Degain the beggar got himself kicked out of the temple of Debella. Caused quite the ruckus. <laughs> nah. Gotta do something to get kicked out of a temple. Some fool is opening a museum in Dawnstar. Wow, these guys got they a lot of stuff for me to do. Collect artifacts from that old mythic Dawn cult. Got a witch hunter in town. From the How much crap Sundar. do you know? <laughs> Keeps asking questions about that old abandoned house. Did you hear? The Hall of the Dead is closed. <laughs> it's Brother still Barone going. The most popular man in town right now. Okay, it's finally over. Good lord, he had a lot of stuff. Again, the beggar got himself kicked okay, out I don't need that. Bella. Any aspiring mage would do well to look for the college in Winterhold. Yeah, I already knew that there, though. And you'll get what you're after. Although our Jarl's humble wizard might be willing to help you too. Okay, well I'm not looking to do magic. Um I would like a room, though. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Ten gold is like nothing, so we're good. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Okay, good. I actually don't have to go looking for it. I figured, you know, I, I guess I should have figured that they were going to show me anyway. Thank you, Klepper. You can... Let me know if there's anything else you need. All right, that was odd. Please leave my room. Lydia, get out of the man's way so he can leave. Go, 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 go. Damn it. Come, Lydia. All the wood furniture in this inn is rotten to the core. Do you know why that is, Clepper? I don't know, my darling wife. I assume you're going to tell me. Oh, what a snide it's remark. Because the wood is cheap and it's soaked with ale. Oh, snap! All the furniture before bugs. You just got told. Just show the bugs you're I meant to say told, place. but you know. And they'll scurry away in complete fear in no time. Oh snap! You got told back. Why did I ever marry you? Oh! I don't ask that question myself. Oh! <laughs> wow! Look, you got some guests standing here next to you. What is wrong with you two? Unlike my husband, Clever, I watch after our guests. Well, oh, it's very nice of you, except for the fact I'm not hungry, so get out of my face. Lydia, come here. Come in the room. All right, fine. You don't want to sleep with me? Fine, whatever. Stay out. All right, what time is it? It's 11.30 p.m., so we're going to go a nice, cool eight hours. Hopefully getting rid of that whatever disease I have. I really hope, I don't, yeah, I know, it keeps me from a restful sleep, blah, blah, blah. How'd you sleep? Standing there for eight hours. Did the armor keep you up? All right, so I'm going to save here. 
Uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much gonna gonna do it for this episode. Um, we got Lydia back, and now we know exactly how to get her back every time. So this is good. I can just leave her if she won't follow me properly, and I'll just get her back. Any anyway, I gotta write that command down though. Um. I really hope I didn't screw up the audio there. I don't understand why I did that. But that is unfortunately going to do it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me and uh, on, on my adventure to get Lydia back and to come into Markarth and stuff like that. Man, those sounds of Skyrim mods are really cool. It adds such a depth to this place. Like It sounds like there's more people than there really are, but that's kind of the point. Um, and please join me again next week where we'll pick right back up here in this inn room uh, with Lydia not giving us fellatio. And, um... Or maybe I should have said, like, flating our knob or something. I don't know. <laughs> and uh, definitely don't get, forget to check out all the other episodes. We are on episode 20, okay? We are still cruising along. This is fantastic. I'm so excited. I'm just jumping off the walls! And uh, there's 19 other episodes to watch, so if you like this one, check out the other ones, because I think you'll be equally pleasantly surprised. And, of course, don't forget to check the links in the video description below for all the social media stuff, the website specifically, and more importantly, the actual live campaign. Still trying to raise that $200. Still trying to. I mean, I started it in January. We've got all year to raise $200, but let's not wait all year. If you can help, please do. It goes to a great cause. If you don't know what Extra Life is, click on the link, read up on them. They're a fantastic charitable organization, and they help children's hospitals all over the world. So why don't you help them help out by donating? I started off with 25 bucks. The rest is up to you guys. So click the link and donate if you can. And, uh, of course, as always, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. But until next time, guys, I'm Adam Wolf. This is Skyrim. And I will see you guys later.